Hey, <laughs> welcome back to Drawing and Talking with Blue. Um, yeah, today we did something a little bit different. It was late at night, so I decided to draw Playboy Bunny Armin, but season four Armin. And I actually thought of a reason, an excuse to do this. It's because uh, it's canon that Armin looks the best in a bunny suit. So I uh, drew him in one. Um, yeah, uh, I tried to match the style as much as I could because I really didn't feel like trying to figure out my style. Um, and so um, that was actually kind of difficult because uh, with the line art, because I had not only had do I, did I have to like draw the eyes well and just I had to draw it well but I also had to it's not something that uh he's drawn you know so I really had to get that like the lines and stuff down like you do um this is just me trying to get uh shading and like coloring and how he works with colors um yeah, it was actually really fun. I actually really enjoyed the process. Um, yeah, it's season four I'm in because I felt like drawing him with an undercut and his hair was really hard to draw. His long hair. Um, yeah, uh, I still haven't watched the new uh, episode because I um, don't have Crunchyroll Premium and I can't find it anywhere else. That doesn't like require me to pay um, for it, that <laughs> require me to pay for it, um, yeah, so I don't know if Armin has showed up yet or not, um, but I'm excited to see what, uh, happened with Reiner and, uh, Aaron in the basement. I saw a really funny meme that was, like, um, Aaron season one to three. I have to find out what's in the basement, Aaron season four. I am the basement because he was in the basement. It was very funny. Um, but okay, wait, I'm actually very excited because uh, a few videos back, I forget which one it was, what video it was. I talked about my theories for Attack on Titan uh, for the ending because I don't, I haven't read the manga. And I don't plan on reading it anytime soon, um, before the anime finishes. So, and my theory is that it's just a big time loop and Aaron Yeager is the dude that you saw at the end talking to, uh, Grisha about, uh, like, fixing everything. And he said that his name was Kruger, right? Aaron Kruger. And Grisha's father, Aaron's grandfather's name is Kruger. And I was just like, oh my god, oh my god, I'm right. And I was very, I was very pleased with myself. Um, here, I just, I just like changed the colors because it wasn't fitting uh, this. Also, you'll notice that um, that was like my main reference picture for the line art, especially his face, because it has like the same kind of, um, like angle which was really nice um and so that was actually really really helpful also because it was official art so that was great i enjoyed that um yeah uh and another thing that i that oh my god i season four is just so good and at first I was kind of like bummed out because like the OG squad wasn't in it, you know, like the Levi squad and everyone on Paradise wasn't like in it. And it was like focusing on like Reiner and Gabby and all them guys, you know, all those guys. And I was kind of like, oh, I want to, I want to see my man's Levi. And I didn't get to see him and I still haven't gotten to see him. But, like, honestly, I'm kind of fine with it now because it's just... I think it's actually really cool seeing, like, Reiner's backstory and why he's, like, depressed, you know? Also, 
like just everyone's relationship with each other and just the inner workings of Marley, I guess. It's just, and like the Eldians and the whole system. I don't know, it's, it's still super confusing and I really don't get it, but I'm not, I don't think I'm supposed to because it's Attack on Titan and the thing is you don't like know anything until you know everything, which is cool. Um, yeah, uh, I'm excited to see the Warhammer Titan though, because in the trailer it looked really cool. And I can't wait for them to go back over to Paradise and like do the mission again. I'm very excited for that. Also, one thing, okay, one thing about Attack on Titan that I don't understand, well, not about Attack on Titan, about the like Eldians is, and Marlians and whatever, is they send, they send children to like determine the fate. And like, I just, that seems kind of wrong, you know? Because you're sending these kids to go into, like, intensive training, inherit a titan, go off unsupervised. Like, they're, like, how old? Like, 12? Right? Like, Aaron was 12 when the attack happened. You know? Reiner and Bert... Berthold? <laughs> I don't know. I don't... I don't know. Were... And Annie were 12 when they took over Wall Maria, you know? I'm gonna look it up. No, I'm gonna look it up. How old? I'm- this is- it's baffling to me. Like, they send out these, like, chill- uh, gosh. How old was Ere when Wall Maria fell? He was ten! He was ten years old. They were 10 years old and they took over Wal Maria. That's insane. Oh my gosh. And then two years later, they started the training. So they started military training when they were 12. That's Aaron and Mikasa and everyone. But Reiner and Annie and Berthold and all of those, all of those folks, they had to start so much earlier if they did it at 10. If they took it over at- oh my gosh. That's crazy, man. That's wild. I could never- um, uh, yeah. A lot of this is just me trying to match the type- like, the shading that he does. It's a lot different than what I usually do. I, I usually really, like, over-exaggerate the shading. He doesn't. He makes it normal. Um, I don't know. I don't do. Um, another thing that I um realized was that ah uh, no, I'll get into that later. Um, but oh my goodness, I got these really cool stickers. Uh, from Redbubble, they had some really they they had some really great uh, Levi Ackerman ones. Anyway, they're really cool. I can I will I will put them. I don't know if I should put them in or I'm not gonna put them in. Um, yeah, there's one really cool one with Dobby dabbing and the eye is crossed out, so it's dab and it's Dobby dabbing. <laughs> I thought it was very funny. Um, they're really cute. I really like them. Uh, yeah. Um, another thing in this video is that you get, you get to see my home screen. I think that happened a little bit ago. Uh, yeah that you get to see that um kind of embarrassing you didn't need to see it but hey it's there so that's pretty cool another thing i realized that um the author of the talk on titan closes all of his lines and like makes everything really clear and defined which i also don't usually do and so that was also a struggle for me. I do not enjoy doing it in the slightest because I think it looks bad when I do it. Um, but yeah, I ended up doing that. Um, also, something I noticed about this video is that it's like a normal length for once. Um, yeah, I think the main issue with this drawing is that I didn't look up a Playboy Bunny costume before I drew it. I kind of just did it, and I don't know if like the colors, 
or anything where the ears are right. Um, I might look that up now. Ooh. Oh my god, <laughs> sorry about that, I yawned. I'm tired. It's only 5.30. Gosh. Um, okay. What am I looking up? Uh, Playboy. Bunny. Outfit. I might do so- oh gosh, okay, this is highly inappropriate. Um, okay, dang, shoot, okay, I messed the ears up. They should be black and red instead of what I did. But that's fine. You know, when you're in the scouts, it's, you're on a low- that's a thong. You're on a low budget, um, can't always afford what you need you know um another thing when i was doing the line art i was drawing bangs and i was trying to draw bangs differently but then i was like oh wait i'm trying to match this certain style i can't do that and i'd go back and fix it and that took a really really long time and i was kind of upset about that but it's fine and it looks fine and everything is good uh i think i already did it but a thing with Another thing with the shading is that he puts these um, little like airbrushes everywhere to make highlights and shading and I had to go and do that and I didn't really notice that until now because I'm really like looking at the art intensely. Um, so that was that was actually really fun to play with and see what like how it turns out. Um, also he does something that I might start doing, he puts little lines where he's putting intense shading. And that was actually really, really fun to do and I really enjoyed it. And I might do that again in the future. Um, on, okay, one thing that I thought while drawing this before I had colored it and before I like fixed everything um, during the line art, you didn't get to see it, but he looked like Jean. He looked like, I'm saying that so wrong. He looked like season one and th one, two and three Jean. Um, with the, his like undercut and his like wheat hair and that was it was very funny i had to i had a good laugh haha <laughs> um yeah uh actually something really funny happened i forgot the little car on them and so uh like an hour earlier and it, like not like two two now like two hours prior to me recording this i went back and i put it in but when i went back to um to uh like put in the collar what happened was half of my layers were deleted and um and uh like and a bunch of them were like switched around and i couldn't do anything to fix it uh luckily i'd already taken a screenshot of this to make this video um and so i just used that but i can i I'll show a picture of what it looked like at the end of this. I saved it because of just how ridiculous it was. Um, it was very upsetting. I had kind of like a sucky day. I have a French quiz tomorrow and I don't know French and French sucks. And so that kind of bummed me out. Um, and just my whole day wasn't the best. But so that kind of just made it worse. Um, also sorry about, uh, oh my goodness. Wait, no, never mind. This, this video is like almost finished. That's pretty great. For once I had a, I have a normal length video. That's wild. Um, crazy stuff, man. Uh, yeah. Uh, this was actually a really fun style to, um, draw in. I think I might try and do stuff like this in the future with other animes that I've seen try and match this style <gasps> oh my goodness i just realized i haven't drawn something from kagaguri i'm i'm most definitely saying that wrong i might draw i might try and draw something in uh that style that's such a i love it so much The i read the mangas i haven't watched the anime actually um but yeah that was i really like the style especially when like they go batshit crazy um <laughs> It's very enjoyable to watch. Um, I might do that in the future. Uh, yeah. That's, that's the finished product. 
I hope you liked it. Sorry it's blurry. I added the color in, as you can see. Um, you can always like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will possibly see you next time. Bye!